lovelies welcome back to another video how are you all doing hope you all are doing amazingly fantastically great as always let's tell almighty god thank you for another bright beautiful and glorious air girl day guys today we are making an effective amazing mind-blowing extreme air growth pomade to apply into your hair and your scalp both your baby's hair every day for amazing results so the first thing i will need i will need my blender then i will go in with all my ingredients guys when it comes to this recipe out here if you are having any scalp and hair problem like alopecia badness inchy scalp shedding slow growth dry and brittle hair this one out here is for you i will need my glove i will need my star and nice i will need my black seed in here i have 30 gram each of all my seed i will need my flag seed all this seed help is stimulating promoting healthy and faster air growth they also help in treating your scalp really really well so if you are having a lot of dandruff inchy scalp scalp irritation shedding from stress from postpartum for alopecia areata then this one out here is for you then i will need 100 ml of my soya bean oil you can add any oil of your choice you are good to go but i always advise you use a lighter base carrier oil like your sunflower oil almond oil grape seed oil and also your soya bean oil the right now i'm going to blend everything really really well into a smooth consistency the main aim of me blending is to enable the oil to enter into all the seed to extract all the nutrients when you are blending make sure you take your time to blend really really well if you don't have a blender or you have only the powders one just infuse your powder and your oil together allow it to sit for up to one week but i always love using this method i mean i will blend all the seed i get much better results when i blend together like so so right now i'm done blending as you can see on the screen i blend everything into a smooth paste and guys this stuff smells so divine smells so amazing right now i will need a clean and sterilized jar make sure the jar you are using is not dirty and it's not wet i will transfer my mixture like so into my jar as you can see me doing then after i transfer look at how it's looking i will now go in with my oil face i will need my avocado oil i will need 50 ml of my avocado oil i'm going to pour into my jar like so then i will need my extra virgin olive oil i will need 25 ml of my extra virgin olive oil you can add any oil of your choice what oil i always love to add more is my moringa oil but today i do not have moringa oil at home i'm using the ones i have so anyone at all you know you have just add you are good to proceed right now i'm going to mix everything together like so really really well as you can see me doing the after i mix i'm not going and give it a good water bath so i will put my water inside my pot allow it to boil like so that i will put my mixture into my pot of boiling water guys this step out here is extremely amazing it enables you to extract all the nutrients from the seed and also without over processing it all right so i advise you all please try this step it's extremely amazing so after the water boil i will now put my mixture like so into my pot of boiling water it's called double eat boiling method so after i allow it to eat up for at least 20 minutes i'm going to open it up then i'm going to stir really, really well like so and when you are staying please make sure you lower your flame don't allow water to go into your mixture as you can tell i use a big and a longer jar make sure the jar you are using is long don't allow water to go into 
your oil. So after about 30 minutes, I will take it down. I will allow it to, to cool down a little bit, okay? To allow air to come out from it. Then I will not cover it up. I will keep in a cool, dry place for minimal, minimal 24 hours. You can leave yours up to one week. You are good to go as well. So I will keep my life. So I will allow it to sit in a cool, dry place for 24 hours. Please make sure you allow it to sit at least 24 hours. The main aim is to enable all the nutrients to come into the oil like so as you can see on the screen. So right now, lovely, after 24 hours, look at how it's looking. It's time to open it up, guys. If you apply this into your hair, into your scalp, trust me when I say you are going to thank me later. Hey, hey guys, no matter how strong, how stubborn your hair is, your hair cannot resist this recipe, this oil out here, this treatment. You can never resist it at all at all so i'm gonna mix it together i'll now go in with my clean and transparent bowl i'll now go in with my sheets cloth you can use your t-shirt you can use your filter or your stock but make sure anything, anything that you are using is not wet and it's not dirty so i will transfer my mixture like so into my sheets cloth that i'm going to strain as many oil as possible as you can see me doing so after i strain lovelies make sure you strain as many oil as possible here is the amount i will be working with so i'll now go in with a pump of water and i eat to boil i'll put in my little transparent bowl let's go now into the next phase of the butter phase i'll put in my bowl like so it's called double eat boiling method i will need my butter face start with my shea butter you can add any butter of your choice you are good to go i will need 30 gram of my soft shea butter or refined shea butter then over here i have 20 gram of my all refined cocoa butter then i will now go in with my bee wax you can use your soya wax or emulsifying wax you are good to go then right now i will need my coconut oil i will need 20 grams of my coconut oil if you don't like this one out here you can also skip it you are good to proceed i will allow anything everything to mix together please when you are missing, don't allow water to go into your mixture because you don't because you don't want to go bad like the next day. So make sure you you take extremely you are extremely careful. Don't allow water to go into it. So right now, I'm going to mix together. Allow everything to melt to some state. After everything melt for some time, I will now go in with 50 ml of my oil mix, the one I strayed earlier on. I will need 50 ml of that. Oil. you can make a butter from it or a oil from it or a pomade i love making oil i love making my pomade or my butter we are good to go depending on the state of mind that i'm into okay all right so right now i'm going to mix it together really really well like so mix until everything made completely so after everything made completely i will take it down allow it to cool down for some minutes don't proceed when, when it's too hot okay Right now, I'll go in with one tablespoon of my organic honey, guys. You can also skip it, but I love honey when it comes to my hair. Honey keeps my hair moisturized. It absorbs uh, moisture from the air into my hair, all right? So I'll now go in with my essential oil. I will need 10 drops each of my essential oil, nearly my tea tree essential oil, my carly dust, and my permit essential oil you can add any one of your choice you are good to go this one i'm using the one my hair love i'm used to are the ones i have all right so if you have any one like rosemary lavender just add lovelies you are good to proceed so after i added all my essential oil into it because they are so good in treating your scalp if you're having antibacterial antibacterial anti-inflammatory to suit any inch scalp like dandruff irritated scalp to help suit your scalp really really well minimize shedding and also breakage right now i'll go in with my jar like so i will transform my pomade into my jar as you guys see me doing they are going to quite up make sure if you put it to your jar you allow it to cool down for some minutes because don't it will form it okay so right now i'm going to put it inside my fridge for up to 30 minutes if you live in a in a cold cold 
cold environment just put in your closet in your kitchen your cupboard is going to solidify as well so at 30 minutes guys look at how it's looking everything has solidified completely and guys this for out here please just try it you are going to love it you can apply into your air into your scalp little and matte every day for effective results or better see you can add as a pre pool hot oil treatment for your moisturizer if you are doing a twist art a braid art or moisturizing you are good to go for all air type natural relaxed and dreadlock both kids and adult air. and lastly as a body massage you are good to go to massage your body as a body pomade yes love it to keep your skin well moisturized that's many amazing nutrients in there today is my little girl moisturizing and also styling day i'll be working in a freshly washed clean air guys yes i'll put her air in session i love to work in session so if you are if you have a longer air, guys, and you are treating your air, moisturizing your air, always try and put your air in session. Working in session is extremely life saving. At the same time, I want to appreciate you all for your amazing love and your support. This get out here is super duper grateful. God bless you one after the other. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Jerry. I'm into agro tips, skincare, and weight loss. Glass from my channel or my page. If you love what you see, please help me to like, share, comment down below, follow, subscribe. It's free of charge. And God bless you as you do so. Amen. So as I can tell right now, guys, I don't add anything to her hair, only the pore because her hair is still wet. I just finished washing her hair. So I actually have some water before I add, I put the pore to keep the to seal in the moisture. But if your hair is dry, guys, spray in some water or your egg water into your scalp, into your hair. Before you add the pomade into your hair, don't add the pomade into your hair or your scalp when your hair or your scalp is dry. No, you want to put something to seal in the moisture using the pomade, like your leave in cream or your egg roll water. You can add your glove water, fenugreek water, your star and anise water, or your black tea water, or your normal regular tap water. Make sure you dab your egg water before you add this pomade. So right now, I will go in with my detangling brush with the tango air guys if you see my arm moving so fast i only fast forward the video okay i'm not be rough into to our air all right the right now i'll put our air in a braid like so natural braid to stretch our air really really well guys it's extremely amazing you put your air in a simple stretchy style like so like a twist or a braid so right now our air is dry so i will spray in water okay because our air now is dried up because our air tend to dry really really well so i will spray the water massage the water into our air really really well i will now use in my pomade to go into the air to see in the water moisture i will start from the tip of our air working it down the root of our air that will make sure every strand of our air benefit from this pomade by doing some good figure detangling with my eye allowing the pomade to go into everywhere at all at the same time i will massage a scalp with this pomade yes if your baby has a lot of build up a lot of an uh, inchiness a lot of what have you just make sure you massage into a scalp really really well as you can see me do it so right now i'm done with the whole of our hair as you can see our hair is looking so moisturized so shiny all i added is water and the pomade she is good to go guys simple is like less is more all right so right now look at our hair i want to go in extra pomade into my palm to focus it now into a scalp yes massage 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 your scalp massage your scalp is therapeutic it sends good signal to your brain it helps stimulate air growth and also promoting air growth so always give your, your scalp a good tlc by massaging your scalp and lastly i'll put a hair in one bone like so baby girl is good to go for another at least at least one week before i proceed so lovely done and dusted with this will come to the end of today's video thank you for watching god bless you until i will see one in the next one if you like it please help me to like share comment down below flow is free of charge remain blessed 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 and you know what peace bye bye i love you all ciao ciao you owe me a lot to me don't forget it okay